good day friends let's return to our Google Slides project by using the apps button and choosing slides remember it was called computers one with your initials and you can simply click it to launch it at this point we will all have six slides and remember the other day we added the sweet slide transitions our first step today is going to be to add some speaker notes so click down on the speaker notes slide and add the following simply put remember to speak clearly take your time with each sentence now we're not going to give this presentation in front of the class but those are just smart things for if you are ever going to give a presentation to somebody if this were a real presentation you were giving you could add notes about things you wanted to make sure you covered that you may not have put in your slides at this point I want you to insert a new slide you can use whichever strategy you prefer and I want you to title this presentation tips in the bottom of this YouTube movie is a link to this page with 10 presentation tips once you get to this page I want you to copy the link I want you to go back to your slideshow and on the left side I want you to type the following please type when you create a presentation it is good to have an idea of strategies that help you get your point across the website on this link has a lot of good ideas you may follow when you've got that done select the word this link and click the link tool and then take the URL from this page and paste it in once again all you do is select it right click copy paste it in the box and apply it and now when people are viewing your presentation they could click and view the web page press enter below that and write this sentence I have listed a few of my favorite strategies to the right and then in this box I want you to make a bulleted list once again I'm going to show you that you can do the fancy bullets if you want so I'm going to do stars because these are my favorites and then it is up to you to pick three of the ten and just summarize them don't type the whole thing but summarize them so for instance I'm gonna pick start strongly you can pick something else of course and you're doing at least three of these and explaining what it means to you to start strongly so I put start strongly making sure that your audience is excited to hear what comes next in your presentation so remember you need at least three of these you can go back and read them do not copy and paste what this person said instead I want you to take what they said and say it in your own words let's go back to one of our earlier slides where we added a picture like our typing one because we haven't used a lot of single pictures and let's use another cool technique called an animation click on your picture and when you click insert animation it lets us animate that single piece so our slide is already going to dissolve but check this out we can make our little buddy fly in from the left which currently would only happen when he was clicked I would rather have that happen with the previous I think so let's see what this looks like now when we start our slideshow when I hit present look at how that comes in just because it was the start of the slide and that's how I want that to happen I want it to be with the previous I want to also alert you to the background tool uh, you can add a background I'm gonna choose one from my computer and just show you that this is not a good idea this is a picture that was on my desktop and watch what this does to my whole project when I hit done you can see that applies to that page and it just doesn't look right but look how quickly we can switch it back if I hit reset to theme I have fixed and none of my stuff is broken anymore that is one of the amazing things is you can switch and adjust your slideshow so quickly by simply clicking the little spots and adjusting it let's insert another slide using whichever technique you prefer 
And let's title this one Scratch. Simply put in this box, Scratch is a neat programming site that allows us to learn code really quickly. Add that we created a really neat game called Zoom in just a few minutes. And then let's visit the HL Mod Tech YouTube channel. And when you get there, look for the playlist by clicking the playlist choice and finding the Zoom playlist. When you click on the word Zoom, the list pops up. I'm going to make sure that's mute so it's not loud. What you have to do is click on the little playlist to get back in it. You can copy the top and add this to our cool presentation. Type here is a link to the playlist. Select it. Click your link button and paste it in. Test your link to make sure it works. That is exactly what we want. If yours isn't, just do those steps again. And then on this side, let's delete the box and let's use another awesome tool called WordArt. Let's type the word Zoom with the exclamation point. Notice it has edges that we can grab, rotate, and adjust. I'm going to shrink it a little bit. We can switch to a cooler font, so I'm going to use Pacifico. I'm going to pick a cooler color. And then I'm going to do Control C and Control V, so there's two of them. This is one of my favorite tricks. And I'm going to get them right on the edge of each other, and I'm going to make the second one a different color so it looks 3D. I'm going to zoom in one click so I'm closer. Now I'm going to go back to that pick tool so I can see that I really got it lined up just the way I want. And now I'm going to zoom to fit and check that out. We have used cool word art to show off the cool things we've learned in Scratch. Once you've reached this level, make sure you turn in a screenshot of this page and you can head to your next group of explorations. Friends, if you found this training useful, please hit that like button. If you haven't hit subscribe, please click that groovy subscribe button. And if you want to be the first to know when there's a brand new movie from me, HL Mod Tech, hit that notification bell. If you got a question or a comment, please add it below. And friends, thanks for watching. Have a great day.